Oh. Hey guys, welcome back to the Wild Dog Project 365, episode 1474. Guys, if you're following along on YouTube, please jump on over to thewilddoc.com. Check out all of our full length videos. That's where we house them. What we're using today is the Theragun uh, Viber vibrating percussive device, right? Um, and we're using it to release our hip flexors. It's something I haven't shown in the past, so I would figure I'd go ahead and show it to you. Yes, I understand that you need to have a Theragun or some other percussive device to get this done, but um, still gets, you know, showing you another way to do so. This is the Gen 1. Uh, I don't even think you could get this anymore, but I have one of the earlier models, okay? So in any case, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna lay onto your side, right? And you're gonna find your hip pointer bone. From your hip pointer bone, you're just gonna come down off that bone into that soft gully. I'm gonna put my thumb there. I'm then gonna replace it uh, with the Theragun itself, all right? So right in that position, okay? So from right there, I'm just directing straight back towards my hip. And I'm just gonna hold that there for a couple seconds and allow that percussive device to do its job, okay? As that tissue starts to relax, I can move up and down just a little bit. Now, when we release hip flexors, especially on our side, we're really thinking about this little diamond shape, basically from that hip pointer bone, one third of the iliac crest, so one third of your hip bone, and you put your fingers together just like such. That, this space right here, that's where you're looking at to be able to use this uh, Theragun device. So I'm just gonna start to do this now. Here's what I want you guys to do is I want you guys to start using movement with this so we can find a hot spot. From that hot spot, we can start to do a couple things. We can open our leg like such, get a little rotation in here, or we can bring this leg up forward into flexion and then into extension. All right, so you can switch back and forth, external rotation, flexion, extension, external rotation, flexion, extension. And it really allows us to get a little bit of vibration, really help improve those gliding surfaces of the tissues um, as you're trying to cool down. Okay, so cool? Cool. Questions, comments, uh, guys, throw it below. As always, uh, we're here each and every day optimizing function to optimize performance.